Pharmacodynamics of Medications for Opioid Use Disorder. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration has approved three medications for the treatment of opioid use disorder, methadone, buprenorphine, and naltrexone. These medications help to normalize brain chemistry, alleviate withdrawal symptoms, reduce opioid cravings, and reduces the risk of overdose through opioid blockade. Opioids boost dopamine levels by stimulating molecules called mu-opioid receptors that sit on the surface of certain neurons. Each medication's affinity, or attraction, to the mu-opioid receptor determines its binding capacity and ability to prevent other opioid attachment. The medication's activation of the mu receptor determines the body's opioid response. Methadone is a full agonist opioid. It has a high affinity for the mu opioid receptor. At a therapeutic dose, methadone prevents other opioids from binding to the receptor site, decreasing overdose risk. Like other full agonists, such as morphine and fentanyl, methadone fully activates the mu opioid receptor. Methadone is metabolized slowly, preventing withdrawal symptoms and cravings. Methadone can be administered any time prior to the onset of opioid withdrawal or in mild opioid withdrawal, as it fully activates the opioid receptor. Methadone is available in an oral tablet and liquid form. Buprenorphine is a partial agonist opioid. It has a higher affinity for the mu opioid receptor than full agonists, including methadone, and can displace full agonist opioids at the receptor. Similar to methadone, when buprenorphine is bound to the opioid receptor, it may act as a blocker, preventing other opioids from binding. Buprenorphine partially activates the mu opioid receptor, reducing withdrawal symptoms and cravings. Additionally, it has a sealing effect that enhances the medication's safety profile preventing overdoses from occurring at increased doses. Buprenorphine is available in transmucosal film, sublingual tablet, and injectable form. In some formulations of buprenorphine, naloxone is added to reduce the risk of misuse. Naltrexone is an opioid antagonist. Naltrexone has the highest affinity for, or strongest attraction to, the mu opioid receptor and blocks all full and partial agonist opioids from binding. Naltrexone does not activate the mu opioid receptor and therefore does not reduce withdrawal symptoms. Naltrexone's lack of activation at the mu opioid receptor results in a decreased tolerance for opioids. Naltrexone is available in an oral tablet and monthly extended-release injectable form. The injectable form is preferred for the treatment of opioid use disorder after an initial trial with the oral tablet. Both buprenorphine and naltrexone will displace full opioid agonists from the receptor. If taken too soon, buprenorphine and naltrexone can precipitate withdrawal because, compared to full agonist opioids, these medications result in less or no activation at the mu opioid receptor. To avoid worsening opioid withdrawal symptoms, buprenorphine should only be administered when moderate withdrawal symptoms are present. Naltrexone should only be administered after complete opioid withdrawal, typically seven to 10 days after last opioid use. When helping someone choose which, if any, medication is appropriate for the treatment of opioid use disorder, multiple factors should be considered. These include level of physical dependence on opioids, recovery goals, risk of overdose, feasibility of dosing requirements, current living environment and housing status, and storage options for medication.